You know, as a private investigator, I deal with this sort of thing all the time. And what makes you think someone would want to be you? Uh, what's that supposed to mean? Well, someone must have found something appealing. Yeah, well, uh, you know, my reputation is sterling, and I do have impeccable credit, except for my student loan. That Sally Mae sounds like a nice country girl, but she's the devil's mistress. You know, I didn't know you had to go to college to be a PI. Don't you just fill out the back of a matchbook? Uh, officer, am I detecting a little attitude? Why don't you just come back and tell us if you find anything? Oh, don't tell me you're not going to fill out a report. No. Why not? Look, you say you're a private eye. You yeah. dress like a mailman. How the hell do I even know who you are? I came down here, didn't I? The guy maced me. Well, we can do a whole lot more than that. Well, oh, you wouldn't dare. Greg Haynes, this 17-year-old you see before you, who I might remind you is being tried as an adult, stabbed her multiple times. Greg Haynes knew exactly what he was doing. He's not insane, ladies and gentlemen. He is a cold-blooded murderer. And having heard the evidence, you have no choice but to convict him. Thank you. Mama tells me you got recruited by a college football team, is that right? Yeah. Coach Zellman say the recruiter gonna come by and talk to you. Ain't nobody gonna come around here talking to me about signing nothing. Come on, Pop, you can't do that. The recruiter coming all the way down from North Carolina. I don't care where you're coming from. The white man ain't gonna let you do nothing with that football, no way. Coach Zellman say the recruiter... I'm the one that's saying what counts. I'm the boss, you understand? I'm the boss. You get down to the A&P and you get your job back. Where'd you find this? Right over there. Spot's marked. What about choppers spotted it from the air? Are you sure this is from our plane? Well, Intertech Air Services confirmed the ID number. It's theirs. Okay, what else? Oh, wh where did you find these? A few yards from the chute. Anything else? Yeah. Car tracks come off the asphalt to here and back to the road. Footprints of two, maybe three men. Making impressions of the footprints and the tracks. Sorry. The funny thing is, I don't ever remember you saying I'm sorry. You rip my heart out and think I'm sorry is gonna be enough? Well, what do you want me to do? Drop to my knees? Well, what do you want me to say? Oh, oh Shelly, I'm sorry that you slept with my friend 40 years ago. You know, my wife's in a coma. Let's do adultery. Yeah, yeah, let's do it. No, I don't think so. Well, I don't know why you're being so hypocritical. You forgave your best friend, but you can't forgive me. Yeah, but I loved you. But you threw all that away and drove a stake through my heart. I was young. I didn't know what I had. But you did it anyway. And didn't give a squat about my feelings. Now get out of this house before the pastor side of me takes a vacation. Go! Crown, what are you doing? It's time for you to join your wife and son. <laughs> Butterfly, where's the burial crew? I thought when we purchased this property, we explained the need for efficiency. Brown, you just can't kill Brother Drakes like that. Father, you asked for my assistance and I provided it. He is, Drakes is dead. He's no more. You can't kill somebody cold blood. You can't kill a man like that. God, God. Out here, I am God. Now, Butterfly, take care of his cremation and burial. Carl and Jose, take my, get my father out of here. Hey, don't touch me. Don't touch me. You let him do that? You let him just kill someone like that? Crown! You will be judged, you number know, savages! Every single one of you! Cold-blooded killers! And you will be judged! Mark my word! Oh, God. Lord, what have I done to deserve this? Now, as we all know, next Tuesday is a very important day for our community because we get to exercise our right to vote. And any person sitting here today who is of legal age would be desecrating the struggle of our people not to exercise that right. Amen. 